Okay, good evening everyone. So it's time for our speaking session. So Mitchell, is, are you ready? Yes. Yes, okay. yes, I do. Okay, would you like to introduce yourself? Yes, uh, I'm Mithilesh Prajapati from Chhattisgarh, Korea, Singapore, and I'm a student of science. I passed my, I did intermediate in 2020, and now preparing for some exam. Mm. Okay. Yes, hello, myself, myself, Sagar Soni. I'm from uh, MP and currently wait. preparing for civil service. No, wait. Uh, Sagar, uh, let me tell you one thing. Uh, speak one by one, okay? I'm asking the question to dad. I think he left. Okay. Uh, next question is, um, do you like to travel by car? Yes, I do. If I would have my own car. When do you travel by car? If I would have my own car then. Okay, I think I should change it. Okay, do you use a wallet? Yes, I do. Have you ever lost a wallet? Yes, one time. Uh, when I was sitting with my friends, uh, it was uh, it was near the forest. That was forest area, and in, there was a big stone, a uh, big boulder, you can say. So we were uh, sitting there. My wallet suddenly slipped from the, my pocket and we just uh, came to home. And when I was finding my wallet, then I couldn't find. Then we uh, find we found everywhere, but we didn't get. So my friend told me to go there in that place. And there my wallet was safe. So I picked up my wallet. Okay. Have you ever sent a wallet to someone as a gift? Mm, actually, no. Okay. I do. Do most of your friends use a wallet? Yes. But uh, only like, yes, yes. I, I only have cousins, no friends, so. Yes, okay. you can say yeah. Okay, but e, whatever you say, those sentences are correct because I asked some question related to the past and you use past tense only, so it was nice. But the thing is that uh, your answers should be more, um, like it should contain at least two, three sentences. Some, Sometimes you use like, yes, I do, something like that. And one mistake I want to mention here, you say that we found everywhere. So it could be like, we searched everywhere. Then we find, we found it. Thank you so much. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so Mitchell, would you like to go for part two cue card session? What's that? Sorry. Okay, here I, I will. Have... Yes, yes, you say. Okay, here I will give you a topic. And I would like you to talk about it for one to two minutes. Okay? Oh. And the topic is, des describe a game or sport that you enjoy playing. Describe a game or sport that you enjoy playing. I enjoy uh, mostly swimming and running. These two games only. This is not a game that I uh, like part of. You can say, uh, yes, it comes under the sports when you go for high level. But I like running and swimming. Uh, I like running because from the beginning when I was a child, I used to like, whenever a competition happened in my school. So, uh, I try to like my friends uh, get medals, gold medals and all. I so I feel at that time I feel that I should also uh, get that medal. So I try to run and run and run. So it becomes my uh, like 
favorite running and swimming too uh, till it, i didn't know how to swim so at that time uh, my friends in the like, it was the uh, story of a village where i used to live before so there were lots of my friends at the time they were jumping on a well so i used to go there and uh, used to see that and they were enjoying a lot so i used to think that i should also uh, jump on that and enjoy with them but i didn't know how to swim so suddenly one uh, boy pushed me i didn't uh, have idea about that he would he would push me but he suddenly pushed me at that time i learned how to swim in that jo- uh, in that well so that well was full of water it was uh, during rainy season so it was full of water so i didn't uh, s- uh, sunk at that time so and running so this is how i learned swimming and running is like i always used to wake up uh, when uh, i will i want to mention one uh, uh, is kind of once one event it was going to happen in my school so there was a running competition so i i want to get a medal on that running so i woke up on that running day at 1 o'clock night at morning you said you can say that night or morning whatever so i woke up and just i used to run every day 1 o'clock 9 to 6 o'clock uh, 6 to 8 km so running was my uh, very very favorite uh, is part of game so yes i got the medal at, at last i got ultimately i got that medal what i w- wanted so this was my story okay thank you okay thanks for your answer it, it was nice okay who would like to come up next flower no i try who sagar yes sir topic yes yes now okay i'll session is going on okay sagar a uh, first question to you is what do you do to relax um, um actually general, i maybe uh, i like oh sorry who is talking yeah. uh you yeah, should talk sagar only sagar okay. or sagar sonic uh question is what do you do to relax in generally uh, when i'm feeling bored uh, i try to uh, listen some music for my relaxation okay do you think doing sports is a good way to relax are you there hello hello Hello. Am I audible? Hello. Sagar Sony, don't speak yeah. now because yes. this time for sorry, Sagar. Sorry, sorry, I'm facing some network issue. Now, now, now it's okay. Okay. Hello. Okay, the next question Please. is, do you think... please ask okay do you think doing sports is a good way to relax yeah i think uh, sports is very helpful for our relax because when we are uh, playing or participant in outdoor outdoor game it uh, fits uh, fit our body and it's uh, relax our mind and it's also uh, keep our body fit and uh, in our free time when we uh, we participate in any game and uh, um, we also enjoy our uh, uh, laser time okay do you think uh, students need a uh, sorry students need more relaxing time uh, well do you think students need more well i don't think that students should uh, need more relaxation time because uh, because it's time to uh, 
build up their career and uh, that's why they have to focus on their study and uh, that doesn't mean that they do, they don't uh, have any relaxed time but it should in um, in short time okay next question is what public holidays do you have in your country oh there are lots of uh, public holiday in my country but uh, i i like uh, mostly uh, the public holiday is uh, bangla navasho it is the first uh, day of bengali uh, uh, bengali ca uh, calendar and uh, here uh, all uh, all ages of people and all uh, religions of people are are enjoying and celebrate uh, this day and that's why i like uh, this uh, holiday uh, very much okay what public holidays do you like the most I think you already give the answer of this yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, in the before one only, but the question was what public holidays do you have in your country? Okay, the next question is what was the best holiday of your life? Uh, the best holiday in my life was uh, uh, Idul Idul Fitr, and uh, in uh, when I was young uh, because uh, that time. Uh, that time mostly i enjoyed uh, these holidays and uh, all of my family members and friends uh, get together and we um, we uh, we do lots of things and we um, and uh, we know each uh, we know about each one situation and uh, and uh, that's why i uh, like this holiday very much Okay, Sagar, you spoke well, but the thing is that uh, you need to practice more because you are fumbling. Yeah, yeah, but I'm, you spoke I'm well. Yeah, as a beginner, you spoke really very well. Okay, if you'll practice more, then you'll be better, very soon. So, who would like to come up next? Can I try? I want to. Yes. Yes, flower. Definitely, you can. Uh, wait a second, flower. Uh, Saga is on. Are you there? Yeah, yeah. I am. Hello, I'm there, ma'am. Okay, flower. Can you please wait for some time because Saga is on. Already. Hmm. Yeah, I can wait. No problem. Okay. Okay. Sure. Thanks a lot. Okay, Shagar. First question is: Would you like to introduce yourself? Uh, ma'am, myself Shagar Soni. I am from MP, and uh, currently I am preparing for civil services. And this is my first, you know, first uh, chat uh, with this with this group. Okay. okay. Don't. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Yes, ma'am. E Okay, so do you often go out in the evening? Ah, uh, sometimes I go. I mean, when I want wanna relax or you know, want to uh, you know discuss something with my parents, so I would like to sit there and uh, you know, tell tell how was my day and ask them the same. Yeah. Okay, what do you like to do when you go out? Um, I like. going out i mean sometimes hanging out with friends or sometimes you know going and doing something sometimes riding bike or sometimes you know playing something like for cricket or like so these are some kind of things that you do in times cricket okay and what do you feel after joining this group uh, ma'am i actually this is my first chat and uh, i don't i didn't know what was the purpose behind these groups but uh, when i you know uh, open up the chat and listen listening to the uh, how people are speaking so i was like i should also you know join uh, join talk join talking and 
वट एवर हेजिटेशन बी इन इन मी आई शुड यू नो लिव इट आउट ओके yeah this group is for english speaking only the people yeah, who no, no, no. don't have any yeah. in environment for english yeah, speaking yeah, they can come here and join and let me tell you one thing uh, if someone uh, asking question to others don't interrupt i thought maybe you are uh, new here that's why you interrupt in between but yes, uh, especially in session uh, one by one people talk that's why i try to follow the rules got it ma'am got it okay okay next question okay, is how yeah. how often do you go out in a week uh, ma'am since we are preparing for i mean i i am preparing for civil services so i do not game uh, do not uh, have so much time to you know go and hang out but sometimes i'll try to find a you know one day a week at least uh, where i can go with the with my parents or my friends to have a cup of tea or coffee so it's not on a daily basis but i would like to go on outing uh, at least once in a week are you a happy person obviously i'm so happy with my work and whatever i'm doing so i would like i i would generally generally like to do the work with happiness i mean so that i can get the maximum out of it so Yes, I am the happiest happiest person. I guess. What usually makes you happy? Uh, I like reading. I mean, reading the stuff, especially whatever I am reading, or watching motivational videos, or talking to. I mean, I like talking to people. I am a kind of social person, so I like I like uh, you know talking with people, getting their perspective about the things, and so this uh, this makes me happier. and uh, when i i i'm i'm interested in politics so <clears throat> getting news about what is going on in the country and whatever happening around me that makes me makes me a, makes me grow as a better person and and a aware citizen also so this is a kind of hobby and these things i would like to do yeah ma'am okay thanks a lot for your answers okay now you need to describe an old friend you enjoy talking with uh since i have so much friends i mean i have friends but few of them like everyone has one or two friends you yeah, those are the closest one to you so i like talking to them since we know each other very well like uh, whenever some some other my my friend is in trouble so i get to know about you know i get to know even when when they are not able to say that Yes, something is going bad with you. So I have friends, and we like talking, to, you know, each with each other very well, and we discuss things. Uh, we get to know what is going on there, going on 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 their life and life, and you know, it this gives kind of emotional support to you also. Talking to friends and friends are quite important. I mean, sometimes we are high. I mean, we are. sometimes we need we 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 sometimes we feel that we need no one but there are uh, there used to be the time in life then when you feel that you need person to talk with so friends are important and i am fortunate to have those yes ma'am okay but my question was you need to describe one friend one oh, sorry, old friend I, I, yeah 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 so there was a friend I of don't... mine his name uh, is pradum pradum we are like uh, school friends and we are still very close friend and since i am not living uh, i mean we are at the different place he is doing uh, uh, b and i was preparing for civil services so now we are not able to meet too much but uh, whenever we meet uh, we meet like we used to fun a lot he is like i mean some high like his qualities like he is so calm person and uh, he is something that he is so honest i mean so honest and uh, you can say the the sweet sweet i mean i would like to call him because i he is not he does not talk to other person too much but uh, when we meet we try to you know find the best uh, we we remind our best memories that we shared and so these are the few things that i like about him Okay, you spoke really very well. 
and your english speaking right. skills are also nice i think so um since how long you have been speaking in english ma'am i'm not uh, you know speak generally but i would i like to speak i mean when i got to know about this group so i was like what the hell is going on but when i listen people i should i like ki i like that i should talk here i mean this uh, this is something that gives you a platform where you can express your feelings and uh, you get to know about other people also and since you talk about uh, environment first so i do not live in such environment where uh, you know we can speak in english regularly uh, but i would like to have such one and this platform is giving that kind of you know environment i think so since i am preparing for civil services that why i also need to get fluent in english uh, since there is okay. a provision of interview in our uh, you know process the whole process about interview also so this i think this would be quite helpful for me yeah actually sorry okay. to can i say something wait a second to share wait a second so last okay. question to sagar shoni is that how do you came to know about our group Um, I don't know. I mean, someone has uh, added me to this group. Uh, I actually, since there are so many members, I could not, uh, you know, get to know that who added okay. me up here. But okay, okay, someone added it. me. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Thanks a lot for your answers. You were speaking. I uh, was good. Okay, to share. Thank you. You Thank have you, something. Yeah, actually, uh, I just want to ask uh, your views, both of you. Like, if you get the chance to choose. between these two like your mother tongue or english what would you choose okay but uh, this time i'll session i'll speaking session is going on so after that you can discuss this topic okay sure we will discuss this this topic okay like uh, are you discussing okay. some to- Flower- other topic yeah yeah i'll speaking session yeah. is going on you should uh, wait and listen others then you will come to know that flower are you there Okay, yes, okay. Okay. So the first question to is that uh, uh, what makes you feel unhappy? Sorry, repeat again. What makes what? you feel unhappy? Okay, unhappy. Uh, yes, when someone hurt me, yeah, when someone said me any wrong thing. so that time i feel like means unhappy ki why they are doing this kind of thing i never think another people wrong thing but they are doing with me wrong means they are doing behavior that is not good with me so that time i feel like unhappy we have the talking to people so this thing okay do you have a hobby yeah i have a hobby means i have hobby uh, there there are ma- there are many hobbies like i like to uh, dancing i like to singing and listening music reading the newspaper uh, reading the book novel so this kind of hobby i have and i'm very interested to do this kind of things okay what equipment do you need for it i didn't get it I mean, what equip equipment do you need for hobbies? Like for singing, you need some equipment, right? For dancing, you need some equipment. Okay, let me change the question. Did you have a hobby as a child? As a child, okay. Hello. Yes, yes, childhood. Yeah, I have. I had a. Ha- I had hobby like dancing. I would like to dance if I get chance to anywhere. So definitely, I would like to do that. I mean, I would like to dance. So this is my childhood um in hobbies, dancing. Okay, what hobbies are popular in your country? Hobbies. I don't know what hobbies. What do you think? People have hobbies. okay yeah if people have have a hobby so yeah it's nice because if they are happy so they can uh, they can learn many things they have different different kind kind of skills they knows and many things there are many benefits so that thing they can okay and they can spend their time with them with hobbies so 
ओके थैंक्स फॉर द आंसर्स फ्लावर नाउ यू नीड टू डिस्क्राइब ए फैमिली मेंबर यू आर क्लोजेस्ट टू ओके इन माय फैमिली या इन माय फैमिली मेंबर्स माय सिस्टर इज टू क्लोज सो टू क्लोज बिकॉज़ इफ आई गेटिंग एनी प्रॉब्लम स्ट्रगल सो दैट टाइम या आई सी विद माय सिस्टर एंड सी डेफिनेटली सी सॉल्व दैट प्रॉब्लम एंड दिस इज माय इज वेरी क्लोज वेरी क्लोज सो आई एम कंफर्टेबल टू आल्सो से एवरीथिंग सो दैट्स दैट्स इट ओके You need to describe something you have done together. We have done together. Yeah, a uh, two three. Uh, I'm I'm telling you about two three days ago. I went to my college to the tram with my scooter. I went and that time my pet my scooter petrol was over. So that time I was thinking then how I will how how I will go. So and that and that time there's also petrol petrol pump is also not near. So that time we solved that problem together. and uh, and we reach before the standing so that's all okay flower you spoke really very well and i feel like you are improving day by day thank you yeah because you were spending time in vc i think and you you learn by yourself as well what's mm-hmm. the reason behind your improving can you share Yeah, definitely. Yeah, there is in Telegram uh, since I joined. So there, I, means I have seen there are many good speakers. So yeah, I used to come here and listen to people, and I used to speak. But uh, yeah, I used to uh, listen more and more. So that thing you can think, and I'm also very curious to learning something, in, and I'm very interested to learn English. So that's why. And your English is also nice, so I also uh, I also want to I listen to your English too. So in the time I always come to this time. Oh my God! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because for me also the same thing. I also listen a lot, and listening help me a lot to improve mm. my English. Uh, you know, okay, one so... thing I want to appreciate, like you when you speak English, not so it's very polite and so sweet, and you speak also very slow, slow, slow. So that things I like more and more. Okay, you know, a uh, flower. This morning only I thought that I should speak quite fast. No, But no, don't speak. You told me. Okay, okay. Yeah, everyone have their own way to speak. Okay, thanks for your appreciation. Thanks a lot, Flower. Okay, so who would like to come up next? Can I try? May I? R K. Ah, uh, no, it's Charlie. Yeah. Sorry, okay. what? Ah, uh, no issues. You can go ahead with R K. Then ah. Uh... No, no. Who said? No, it's okay. It's okay. I'm here. Can Charlie. I try? Charlie. <laughs> Charlie. Yeah. Okay, so Charlie, would you like to introduce yourself? um uh, definitely yes hi everyone uh my name is neha so uh, i came from punjab hello and i'm hello ma'am hey guys please yes fati don't don't interrupt in between yes charlie yeah. you can uh, i came here for my ielts preparation and i have to give uh, my gt examination very soon in order to settle abroad Okay, are you a aspirant of IELTS? Yes, ma'am. Oh, that's really amazing. Okay, so let's talk about internet. How often do you go online? Well, uh, nowadays uh, we can see internet is ubiquitous these days, and uh, I'm not an exception in this case. I use the internet very uh, in a broad way. almost i can say uh, i can spend at least 5 to 6 hours on a daily basis doing my online works projects and assignments and apart from that i also use internet for my entertainment purposes okay what's your favorite websites well there are a lot of websites which provide very crucial information and among all Uh, I find Google very interesting because it helps me to get a, uh, data on everything, and at every time I can uh, get a plethora of knowledge about the multi uh, about the multi various things, 
and apart from that uh, facebook is a quite useful website which helps me to connect with my family and friends which are living far away okay do you think children should be allowed unsupervised access to the internet definitely not i am not in uh, agreement to this because nowadays uh, internet is flooded with the fake news and the videos or the content which are not legalized and not appropriate for the children so they must be uh, uh, taken it um, in a negative way for example the crime shows they are uh, seeing on television or internet so they are addicted to that and they can fall prey of that so it definitely the children should allow to uh, watch internet and television but under the supervision of the parents okay charlie your answers were amazing um it seems like you prepare already for us so when uh, have when you I, booked your exam already no actually i have attempted before but i'm not able to get my desired score so i have to try it again hello okay okay there is a not there is some noise from whose side it is charlie are you there yes yes ma'am i'm here okay so um uh, you spoke really very well and i have a confusion like facebook is a website or web app is is it no, not in considered as a website uh no no i also have the same confusion only i'm not sure about it that's why i'm asking yeah. is there anyone if have knowledge like uh facebook is a website or web app it's Even a website also so sure. yeah everything that has uh, that has that is uh, found on uh, web that is already on website so okay uh, on website also <laughs> you can uh, okay okay charlie okay. next uh, charlie you uh, one quick minute uh, may i speak rk after charlie you will get the chance okay uh, charlie no, i want to talk about the improvements that charlie can do in order to score better in her uh, speaking skills okay okay uh, uh, charlie you used uh, the word broad way right you use ex- mm. internet to a broad way you, instead of broad right broad way or uh, something you can use, you can say extensively so okay. that would give you a vocabulary word okay and uh, that can give you a score also so, okay um, i i couldn't hear much but yeah so whatever i heard i you could you can improve there yeah definitely got it thank you e- and one more thing charlie you uh, rather than using agree you used agreement and there's some different between agreement and agree okay. are you getting yeah, yes, okay definitely. yeah you should concentrate on those things yeah. okay so uh, next cue um, card session now you need to de- sorry I now have, you need to i sorry i have one more correction like she said the uh, supervise under the supervisor of parents but it's supervision i have uh, told under the supervision of parents only mm mm-hmm. okay maybe yeah. i have it wrong okay please other person please mute yourself because there's some noise okay thank you chali uh, your cue card is describe an activity you do to keep fit okay uh well uh, nowadays we uh, actually we all belong to sedentary lifestyle so we don't hardly find any time to uh, get some exercises on daily basis but it's very important so in order to remain fit i make sure that i do my exercise regularly at least for 30 to 40 minutes a week uh, a day 
and for that i had started a morning walk and this was due to my father's recommendation because he is a very uh, fit and fit person and he usually do the morning walk daily and he also suggested me that and upon her, his suggestion i got up early in the morning and went to the park nearby my house and there i realized that after getting a fresh morning walk in a serene environment i feel really rejuvenated and i can shun away all my uh, tensions away and it really gives me a great peace of mind furthermore uh, i have also discovered that having this morning walk had impacted my entire day routine as well because uh, now i can do my work more focus and with great concentration and even i can do my whole work of uh, either personal or professional life with great uh, with great precision and apart from that uh, i feel energetic throughout the day and i don't feel any doziness and uh, the most beneficial part is that i am no longer a couch potato i'm ever now uh, shedding some more calories uh, which is very beneficial so that i can get rid of unusual diseases which are caused due to laziness and sluggishness so this is the activity which i used to do to keep okay it was really good Yeah, I also want to mention that Charlie, it was really amazing. You use some amazing vocab like sedentary life, rejuvenate, uh, and co- coach potato. These things are really amazing. So yeah, I want you always in my session. Really, I want uh, today, participants like you. Yeah, today it's the first day I got to know about this high speaking session. because everyone every time i joined there was an editorial session which is not related to any ielts so i mm-hmm. think about this uh, since i was to ask about that when this session daily goes on at what time so so that i can uh, be there always okay there's two timing uh, either it will be at 7 pm or sometime it will like some uh, time late like 7:20 7 pm then something like that or it will be like around 9:20 or 9 so yeah this okay. two time you'll get okay okay, <clears throat> okay so let's go to follow up question by yes. three what do old people in your country do to keep themselves fit well uh i guess uh, old people have different liking as compared to the younger ones i find the older ones mostly uh, doing the jogging in the park which is just nearby my house and apart from that i also uh, there are many laughter clubs in which the elderly people are taking actively part in them to remain fit and happy most of the time Okay, what kinds of sports are popular in India? India is a diverse country, and there are number of sports. I think you just name it, and you can find it in my country. For example, cricket, volleyball, football, and so on. And uh, here, uh, if I have to pick one, then I can say the cricket is the most famous among all the generations, whether it be a uh, elder or older ones. and irrespective to gender also okay do you think young people should play dangerous sports so it depends on their choice i think younger people should be allowed to do whatever they want uh, unless and until they are under the perfect supervision and they have proper guidance and training to do that dangerous sports because uh, in the absence of uh, right guidance and equipment they can uh, fall easily under the dangerous situations which can also uh, have which can also impact their lives okay what else people can do to keep fit besides sports 
there are number of things i think uh, people can do first and the foremost is to keep fit and healthy for a long in a long run people should be happy in almost all the situations secondly they should have the very healthy diet along with the perfect exercise whether it can be in gym or the regular uh, movements like cycling or climbing and uh, last but not the least they can uh, omit the wrong habits like smoking and alcohol which are very dangerous for health so they can just omit that okay and eating fast food also they should omit okay your answers are really amazing you know i just got impressed one more last question is that what can parents do to make their children like sports uh firstly i think parents are the role models so uh children usually copy their parents so if parents themselves play some kind of sports so the child therefore children would find the motivation and encouragement to do so secondly the uh, parents can uh, reward them if they join or enroll in some kind of sports activity which makes them creative as well as make them fit also okay charlie thanks a lot for your answers yeah. thanks a lot for participation also thank you so oh, much okay rk are you there Yeah, I'm here. Okay, Arki, would you like to introduce yourself? Okay, I'm Arki, and I'm from uh, Delhi, Noida, and uh, now I'm doing graduation, and uh, I'm here for improving my communication and English. okay so let's talk about education uh, yeah. are you a student yeah i'm student now okay as i told that i'm uh, in graduation second okay year. can you okay okay what led you to choose your field of study i chose math uh, mathematics from science stream Okay, what led you to choose that? I mean, choose mathematics. What's the reason behind this? Why you choose okay. mathematics? Uh, actually, uh, from uh, the beginning of my schooling, I, my inclination was towards uh, mathematics and uh, also with the science team. So yeah, so that's why I choose mathematics. Although I was good in biology also because. in 10th i got good marks in uh, biology also but uh, my interest was in mathematics and uh, i had to do btech so that's why i chose mathematics okay what course you find most interesting okay in what your school course? or which subject you find most interesting in your school uh, i would say physics because uh, you know physics first of all science is all about uh, it, it it is not something theory it, it is uh, when you study science it allows you to communicate and uh, there is a there is a link between the practical and uh, the theory you read so every time i read science it allows me to uh, imagine what is going on what we we read we see exactly that is uh, that is going through and that is taught to our uh, ourselves so i find it really exciting to learn everything so i would say physics mostly Okay. Science. What subject did you find most difficult to pass? Most, okay, most there uh, were most difficult subject there was like uh, social studies. I mean, social studies I would say history. 
interest in yes, job job that kind of subject because in 10 subject i was uh, i was good in because in social study i have read social study up to 10 studies and uh, in up to 10 class uh, i was good in all the subjects but my social study was not good and i didn't uh, cover the whole syllabus within uh, within the throughout the whole whole day, throughout the whole year, but I just covered in the last you? three months. The last three months of the okay, <clears throat> okay. Uh, now you need to describe a television program that you like to watch. A television program uh, that you like to watch. Currently or in past. Um, what river you want? Uh, in my past, there was <laughs> there was a, this kind of challenges, but I really like to enjoy Sakti Man. And now, currently, I'm not uh, watching television or anything. I just watch uh, uh, short videos, uh, short YouTube video that uh, uh, that is okay. that is related to you know GK and what is going on. Current okay, you are also not a course potted, I think. Okay. I mm -hmm. am, but uh, I do watch uh, uh, movie series or, uh, but not that kind of TV series. Yeah, you should mention that also. Okay. It's okay, recently I watched uh, uh, Prince Gambit. Okay. Okay, so it's time for complete as speaking. Uh, it had because I need to go. So, is there anyone who would like to participate? Okay, thank you. Yeah, yeah, thanks a lot. Okay, so, sorry, I didn't mention that. Okay, sorry, sorry, I didn't mention. No, no. Okay, thanks a lot for participation, and you spoke really very well. Mm, okay, thank you. And uh, I'd like to mention also that whenever I used to come here, uh, there was no proper host. So this is the first time I got to uh, see someone is hosting and uh, your hosting skills are very nice. So yeah, congrats to you. Yeah, sure. Okay, thanks a lot. Okay, so, yeah, so try to join Charlie, RK, and everyone who joined already. I just want to mention, our speaking sessions start from 7, 7 p.m. or something. It, it starts from 7.30 also. So, yeah, try to join. I will try my best to start from 7. So, if you you guys will join daily then i will also be happy and one more thing we upload those session in youtube as well so yeah you can listen your own voice in youtube also oh. yeah you'll so get the link have, can we have the uh, youtube channel link yeah sure uh, just uh, type link in our group uh, then you will get okay. the link of our channel and soon I, I will upload we will upload this video. Okay, thanks okay, a lot. So this is being recorded and this is yeah. Okay, okay. That's nice. You can That's also very... check, right? Like no, well, your uh, level. Uh, I've never seen this before in any group on Telegram. Yeah, that's the refrain. Okay, thanks a lot. Okay, I got to leave. I have to dinner.